You can experience cultural festivities or tour the newly reopened sanctuary at Greek Fest this weekend, but really, you know, a lot of people go for the food. It's pretty good. 10 News digital reporter Madison Stacy went to the festival today and has a closer look at how one of the most popular dishes is made. Hey, what's up guys? I've been camped out at the Greek Fest all day today. I've been trying out some different recipes, specifically the Lukamades is what I'm checking out right now. These guys have been frying them up since Greek Fest opened at 11 today. One of the workers, Gary, tells me the process starts even earlier, though. The chef takes some dough and they toss it into a fryer. Then they come out one by one and they're little pastries, kind of like a donut when they come out. Then they drench it all in this wonderful syrup that's a blend of citrus and honey. Then it's all topped off with cinnamon and served up for $4. Now, the line for Lukamades normally wraps around the corner, but it's one of many Greek recipes the folks here have been enjoying all day today. Things like spanakopita and baklava sundaes and saganaki. But there's also things like Greek pizza for the kids. And that's all served up with a side of Grecian culture, of course. I've pretty much been eating everything in sight, but make sure you head to WBIR.com to get the full review of everything you need to know that you need to try if you're going to head to Greek Fest later this weekend. Thank you, Madison. Greek Fest is still going on tomorrow from 11 to 8, and if you're looking for other things to do, you can celebrate Hispanic culture at the Ola Festival in Market Square. That's from 11 to 6. There's also the running of the wieners at Schultzbrau at 4.